From the campus of Mount Mercy College and brought to you by the staff of the Mount Mercy Times, this is Mount Mercy Times TV. Hi, this is Brian Heineman, Editor-in-Chief of the Mount Mercy Times, bringing you a follow-up on an article that ran in the December 2nd issue of The Times. I sat down with freshman volleyball player Brittany Thomas, who had a record-breaking season, to talk to her a little bit about her accomplishments and to get a little bit of a glimpse into her personality. Well, I went to Marion High School, which is about 10 minutes away, So, and I was always a homebody, so going too far was never an option. And with volleyball and with the amount of scholarship I could get here, it just kind of worked out, and I love Mount Mercy now. So, Well, it's kind of nuts because I know that it's been tough for great Mount Mercy players to get recognition in the past. We have so many great players, and I guess I feel very, very fortunate to be recognized this year when there were so many other girls who did such a great job. I mean, I came out of my high school career, and I had um, 1,000 kills, 1,200 kills maybe my whole high school career, and I just half that this past season, and I've never done that before. So, I mean, it was pretty incredible to be able to be such a big part because I wanted to help those girls as much as I possibly could because I know in the past it's been a struggle to get so many wins, so any way that I could help. Um, I'm really, really close to my family. I have two younger sisters, and um, they're just starting middle school and high school, so I was really glad that I could stay close so I could help them transition into that. But I've only stayed at home twice, and well, I stayed home Saturday night, and that was my second time. And I think the big thing is I told my parents that even though I'm so close, I want to be able to distance myself because otherwise when I go home, I won't want to come back. But I'm very close to my parents, and it's very hard being away from them. But it's college, I have to do it even though I'm 10 minutes away. <laughs> I was very, very, very shy in high school. It took a lot to get me out of my shell, and I know my roommates helped me a lot with that because she's a lot more outgoing than I am. So, I mean, she's gotten me, to, gotten me to do a lot more things. Like, we'll go out sometimes, or she'll like, you know, force me to go do this and this, and it's been really good. But it's just, I've always been like a quiet person, so I guess it's a comfort zone to be in my room a lot, but it's getting better and everything, so sooner or later I'll break out of my shell. <laughs> uh, when I was in second grade, I uh, fell off a merry-go-round. And well, I don't know why it's a favorite memory, but I always get jokes about it. And I fell off the merry-go-round. I was, someone was pushing too fast, and I tried to jump. And I got caught, and I hit my head, and I broke my head open, I broke my collarbone. And so I have a Harry Potter scar now up top. And so I always get made fun of for that. And I think, I don't know why it's my favorite memory, but <laughs> I always think about that when someone asks me about my childhood. <laughs> so. While individual accolades are sure to continue, Thomas was a first-team all-conference this year, and she's already in the top 25 on the career list for kills at Mount Mercy College. She's more concerned about improving as a team. In the year before she came to campus, the volleyball team went 8-32, and and in her first year this season, the team went 18-18, and and that's a trend Thomas hopes to continue. For Times TV, I'm Ryan Heineman.